Hello, Percy Metal here, and today we're going to be playing some Minecraft on the open server. This is the open server 9, and I'll just be doing a little world tour today and some other stuff. We'll be probably doing some enchanting and maybe starting to build a new house because this one, to be honest, is very bad. It has no detail to it. So let's get into it. So I picked out this area because it had a village. This is a map of it. So it's quite nice. It's quite a nice area. I might just the map. Have a mesa I can go to. Got a lot of the biomes around here. I think I think I got all of them nearby to me. And I only have two villages here. And these are the two buildings. And this is the blacksmith I converted into my first house. He has a bed here, it had more chests in here, but I moved all the stuff out. Still some stuff in here though. Oh, there's iron boots. No. The leather ones are pretty better. I haven't actually checked in these furnaces. No, it's definitely not. Doesn't surprise me. But yeah, this is my first house. And then this is this uh, um, library that came with it. Took out the bookshelves as well. My farm over there, never portal. I got my potato field and carrots and wheat. My little dock, it's kind of bad. But it's just a little quick thing to do. I like sugar cane. And if you heard just a second ago, heard a chicken pop out an egg. I got this whole chest full of eggs. I don't have that many chickens in there, it looks like a lot, but there's not actually that many. I don't have all my animals. I don't have any wheat on me. I've got a lot of cows and sheep. My nether portal. I'll show you this first. where it comes out, well, I didn't come out, it came out up for there, but that, it, when I went back through it didn't take me to um, my house, so I made it exactly where it needs to be, and this makes it over lava, but it's not the best, yeah I got it, dispense a minecart, not all, it's not all the way, but it's quite far. And he's got a bit of packed ice. Sounds pretty cool. You're running along it. Kill these. Go back to my base in a minute. And then this is to the Nether Fortress, where my other friends' portals are. Oh, hang on. He just needs to die. Why does it knock me off into lava? I think there's lava down there. Actually, I don't want to look, there's another cast. But there's bad stuff down there. I fall to my death. There's never fortress here. I think I may go back. And it's just down there. And also, we found four blaze spawners. We haven't to make anything yet. Plans is to do some mining today to get some more diamonds so I can use these levels to enchant and maybe start building a new house. Not sure. I just run along here. I'll see you back at the house. We're back at the house now. I showed you this bit already. Oh, I should go and show you a village. Mm. Show you my house and my mine. The mine does connect, um, connect up to the house, so 
I'll just go around here. So this is my house. Not the best, but it's all right. We have acacia and um, oak. Or oak logs and all acacia. And light green stains. Glass panes. Don't have much detail on it though, so I don't really like. So I'm planning on making a new one. So it's all my stuff. I've had, I've had, I think it's three efficiency five picks, but I've always died in armor with them. And also good swords, but I do have a good sword now. I also had really good armor as well. Well, not um chest plate and legs, but I had good uh, diamond helmet and boots. But I died in love with them, so that's why I'm planning on doing some enchanting. So this is my storage room. Got my auto fishery here. It's more plain here, more basic style, and then more. Oh, I think it looks nicer this bit. Got all my chests. And stuff. Got my ender chest here. Got my anvil. And then there's tons of storage. That's the way to my mine. We go up that way. So I'll show you my auto brewery first. This is where you fill up the water bottles from. So you just hold here, fill up your inventory. Just drop them all into here. There's a little window here. Then never vault here. Oh, forgot about this. This goes to the underground village one I'm gonna make. I think I'm gonna place the ladder so in case any zombies spawn. Then this is all my storage for my potions. Got quite a few. This is Ethos Labs design. I decided to make it because it's a good design. And it's simple as well. But I added another one here, I don't know, really know why. I just had a bit of a dirt for a moment. And then it just gets brewed up here. the last brew. These are the last ones I brew, brewed. I know I left it on so I mean you had to just fix it. There we go. And you just have to do this just to fix it. I'll just turn all of these off because no you need to have them on. That just makes it so you want that certain item to go through. And yeah, that's my auto brewery. And that's to the underground village, what isn't made yet. Going to our mine. Oh, just our little cave. And that just goes to nowhere. So this is where the enchantment table is. Enchantment level 30. It's got efficiency 4 in it, I think. I went on breaking 3 though with it, so I need to get some more diamonds though. And then I got all my rabbits here. Made their area look nice. And they even eat the carrots, the top of them. And then it's like they, they're fully grown and they eat them to that and then they regrow. They don't breed though, they just randomly eat them. I find pretty funny. So these are all my rabbits. There's my little rabbits area. And this cave needs to go out to the top so I blocked it off. And then we've got one brown one. Cause I don't know how I got it. Because I got these from the desert. It took me a little while to get them all here. But when I bred them, the yellow ones, I got a random brown one, I don't know how. Must just work like that. And this is a wheat field for the 
changes. Whatever they were. There's one. Ah, no. There should be another one. Get one. This one. Pretty bad. Then this one. What's all right, librarian? Must be. Oh, it's a block that off. He almost just disappeared then. Must have got killed. Because they normally stay down there when we come up here. Maybe he escaped and then died. I don't see any of them now. Because there should be some. Another one here. Oh well, still got two at least. Always need two. If there's any less than two, then that will be a problem. Let me make this room bigger. Can say trample the props. We can just do that now. Let me keep it lit up though. Don't want any zombies spawning. Because that's how they die. <laughs> Rabbits just chill there. Rabbits are funny though, because they always just jump around. Not down here. I may add fences here so they don't just fall out. Bring us to the um, underground village. Let's go down here. Maybe down here, I'm not sure. Don't hear any villagers. It's still under construction, this bit. Oh, look, he is down here. Okay, so he's not dead. I think he feels a bit lonely. He wants to get back to the village. Well, we know they can't die, at least. Because I think a zombie would have spawned and killed him by now. I was thinking of expanding this a lot more. Oh, Enderman. Oh, he won't look at me. Why won't he look at me? Oh, I hate it. Body. No. It's a bit broken, console edition. Kind of annoying. May go adventuring in this cave, because I need to go mining. I showed you my area. There, so they can't get out, and nothing can get in. So yeah, I think I'm gonna go mining. Oh yeah, wait before I go mining, I just want to show you this. Oh, something about in a subscriber wall. I think I'll do that this episode after I've been mining. So this is to my mind. Not really much. Chest just for excess blocks. Like kind of a quarry I made. And then over here. There's a growing bit. Oh, it's just for growing big mushrooms, not for them to grow out, but they do grow out like that as well. So I'm not keeping any mushrooms.
You need to make this look more pretty. So yeah, I think that's all. Oh wait, wait, wait. There's another thing as well. In the mine. Massive packed ice pit. That way's to the skeleton spawner. And this way's to the zombie. I got my 40 levels from the skeleton. And then zombie this way. But I'll cut to the zombie spawner and the skeleton spawner for you. So this is a zombie spawner. It's got a chest full of loot that they drop. And they've got storage chests. Make swords. Some random stuff. Oh, that's where my thing last went. Because I left it here. In the ender chest. to put it down every so often the baby zombies and they are very loud. Do <laughs> you use stone swords on them? On them. That's why there's wood here and cobblestone. <laughs> They just start spooling up. And then you have one hit, what's well, actually two hits, because I can't get it one hit for some weird reason. And then auto as well. And that's really it for the zombie spawner. But it's a bit inefficient because of the baby zombies that get in the way of you try and kill them when they're one hit. It's annoying. And I'll see you at the skeleton spawner. And this is a skeleton spawner. It's not that far away. The zombie and skeleton ones aren't that far away, but it still is quite far, but when you have packed ice and you're jumping, it's not that far. Or just normal ice. This hasn't been finished, as you can probably tell. But this one doesn't need to, um, one there. I did build it with it, but I accidentally broke it, but it doesn't really matter because it's, um, it's skeletons and look, there's no baby skeletons. And it's a lot more efficient because there's no baby skeletons that get stuck in the water stream. Just changing that. You just wait here, just put elastic band around my controller. But I, it's not an automatic AFK farm because doing this does slowly take down your hunger, so it's a semi automatic. I mean, okay. This one doesn't have any. Does this one just pick up the stuff manually at the moment? So I need to change that. But I haven't done that yet. Yeah, I'll keep this one on. And that's why I need to make it so you come up like at the back here. The ladders. Oh, I have ladders on me, so. Or not, because I can't count apparently. So then you'll come up here. So then it'll be ladders all the way up to here. be all the way up to the top. I think I could actually finish this now. A bit slower crafting in um, console than PC. But I still use classic crafting. I find it nicer. And also you can actually repair stuff. You can't do that in um in 
doing like the console crafting. And there we go, that's fixed now. Lucky I got a fix on me. Oh yeah, I don't have my skin. I'll change back to this skin. That's better. It's from hide and seek. Skeletons must have drowned or something. They don't normally die like that. I hate these slime dudes with me. And the lapis. Yeah, I see you after my mining trip. See ya. I'm back from a mining trip, it wasn't that successful. This is all I got, I got no diamonds at all. I got a lot of ore though. But it's really annoying because I wanted some diamonds, so I don't think we're going to be doing any enchanting today. So, and also we're probably not going to build the house, so I think I'm going to make a subscriber wall. I need some logs, I'm not sure what ones I should make out of. I, and also, I stocked my pick to me, bro, that's why I'm going to be using the iron one now. I only have one diamond, so I can't even repair them. But I did kill, I think it was two endermen. Yeah. I got some ender poles, so. That's better. And also I found a, um, another zombie spawner where I got a um, name tag. And an extra saddle, that's really it. So, we need to start smelting the sign before we build the um, thing jiggy. Subscribe for wall. And won't be able to silk touch this horse, which is kind of annoying. So, gold needs smelting as well. No, oh, I mean, did I say silk touch? I meant fortune. But I just need to smelt this up. Now, a block of coal. It's just easier, I find. There's already some coal in here, but I filled back up some coal. So then w that's getting smelted, I think. But then use hardened stain clay. Not sure what colour I should pick. I'll be back with the materials. And we're back, and I've got the blocks. These are the blocks I'm going to be using. All of these ones. Got acacia and hardened stained clay. I'm deciding where to build it. I think I may build it along this wall. I'm not sure though, because there's nowhere else really to put it. So I think I'm just going to build it along this wall. So I need to do some clearing. Like, should I take this wall all the way back? I think I'm going to. Let's just clear this out quickly. It's a lot slower of an iron pick. Like so, inside, like in the wall, I'm probably gonna have like blocks like this. Then like a pattern with the clay. I'm not really sure to be honest at the moment. Be like just like an abstract kind of design, something like that, and then the name will go. The names will go along here. But yeah, I'll uh, be back when I've cleared out more of this wall, as some of this is complete. Hello, and we're back, and the wall has been made. This is the sign. Just repeated all along. I like it, I'm not sure about you though. You can post your comment in the description, if you like it or not. And there's this little acacia opening bit here, because there's a cave behind here. And I've lined up the thing with a pattern. Just four added eggs as a cave, so in case I need to access it. Then the top one that it goes like this this is how people subscribe to me, like the first one. So it's that one, and then this one. So LPS Gaming was the first one, and Cameron Davies was the second one. It just goes like that. I added the whole wall, everybody's name. You can look at it because I do respect the people who subscribe to me. This is all people so far. Doesn't look like that many, but it did take a little while to write all their name. And also, all their channels will be linked into the description below. 
So, I think that's going to be it for today, guys. Leave a like if you enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one.